Hey guys, Damien here from Above and Beyond. I'm just going to show you some of the key features of our new Elevate theme that we've released on the Big Commerce Marketplace. We've created Elevate uh, in three different variations. So there's a fashion version, uh, there's also an auto and a darker version here, and there's an outdoors version. All of these can be fully customized by changing the colors to suit your branding and needs for your uh, different industries that you have. Um, so the first thing that I wanted to point out with our theme that makes it unique from others is the ability to show uh, the swatch available swatches that are for a product. So say if you have this product here that's in you know four different colors, you can click the user can click these options and see the corresponding image change. Also, if there's a product that has multiple pictures, you can cycle through without having to leave the category. So that's a great feature to have. It allows your users to quickly skim through, look at multiple products, look at all the photos, see the available swatches without having to uh, jump into the product details page. So it allows them to make decisions quicker on purchasing. Now at the category level, so say if we go to uh, women dresses, um, you've got a couple of things that are unique as well. We have um, a category banner that sits behind uh, the breadcrumbs and the category title. We also have an expandable category description. Now this is used, it's great for SEO, so uh, you can write a nice descriptive SEO value there. But um, if you click read more, it'll expand out into more text. So traditionally, if you write this much text, um, your whole, all your products are pushed down the page and the user cannot see them uh, initially on the page load. This, this brings everything up higher on the page. Also, I'll jump on to another category over here. It's the same, same sort of structure across the three. So this is the dark version of the auto parts. Um, you have the expandable category description. You also have uh, the sidebar will remember which category you're in and expand and highlight that current category that you're on. And the same goes for our outdoors version. As you scroll down the page, you'll see these lazy load in. We're using lazy load for all of the category images. That's the latest version um, that comes with Big Commerce. And so lazy loading helps um, speed up your website. So when you first load, load the site, it will only load in the images inside your viewport, so inside this window here, and it doesn't load the images that are further down the page because you cannot see them, right? So as you scroll down the page, it will automatically load them in as it needs them. So say if we go to a longer category like uh, women, and then if we quickly scroll down the page real quick, it'll load them in on demand as we get to that location on the page. Now, the next thing I wanted to show you was the theme is fully compatible with the latest version of the Big Commerce Page Builder. So, uh, what does that mean? I'll just grab you. Uh, this is the back end of when you're editing the theme, right? So, as it loads, see these uh, boxes here that says drag and drop widgets here. And you'll see these blocks boxes are scattered around throughout the site. Um, you can drag and drop widgets. So, over here, when when it loads up you'll have the ability to see, you can drop a layout here and see how that's two columns across. You might want to make that three and then it gives you the ability then to then place widgets inside of those. So say if you wanted to put an image there, right? And then on this one, you might want to put a video and then you just paste in the YouTube URL for that video and that will load in there and then over on this one, you might want to feature a product. So we can drop a product in there and we tell Big Commerce which product we want to show. So we would then search our store for the correct product and that will load in there. So we've included the page builder and all of the little widgets uh, drop in areas in, in all the pages throughout the site. So not only on the home page, also on if we go to say a category, um, we'll go to shorts. You'll see that you've got a widget there and below, above and below the uh, category banner, then below the content on the page. And also this is shown on uh, regular web pages 
and inside products. So you've got full ability to load these widgets into your website and fully customize it. Now another key feature to our Elevate theme is the ability to have this category grid on the home page. This supports up to five banners, but you can change the number of this to four or three. And depending on the number of banners you have chosen here, it will adjust its layout. So if you have four, it'll load four across and three, it'll do a grid of three rather than a masonry layout. So you can fully customize and, and place in different photos here. You can change the labels on all of the images. You can change the button text and their locations and links. Now underneath the categories on the home page, you have a trending products carousel where there's a featured area is sit front and center. So we've made the one in the middle, the product in the middle becomes the largest feature. So as you sort of scroll down and see the trending product here, you'll see uh, you can cycle through the images, but as, you, as the carousel changes, it makes the center one uh, nice and visible. So if you really wanted to call out products here, uh, in the trending section, that's a great place to do it. Moving on, you've got the featured area, which I've spoken about and shown you initially. All of these category headings, so the, the title and the subtitle, they can all be fully customized in the back end of BigCommerce. So if I jump back into the editor uh, for the theme, if you go into the theme settings homepage, you can turn all of these sections on and off. So um, say if you wanted to hide the category section, you could click that uh, and you can turn that section completely off and then it disappears. But if you wanted to ch uh, change the title, see how it says shop by category, trending products, you can change all of those. So say if you wanted to say, um, all right, see our categories, that will change. Trending products can change as well. You can even change the um, buy now text too. So all of these, so this section, the trending product section, the featured, our story, all of those can be turned on and off uh, as you need them. Now, if we jump to a category page, you'll see that on the page there is the uh, unique selling point. So you've got four across, you can set up to four, you can go three or two if you like. And in the back end of the theme editor, you can set the icon, you can set the text for all of these. And with the product images, we've got the built-in uh, zoom as you hover, but we've also done a nice pop-up feature where it shows uh, the product title and a nice slideshow. That's unique to our theme as well. And this is unique and consistent uh, throughout all versions of the theme. So whether you're on the auto version or the outdoors version, you have the USPs and also the um, nice slideshow for you as well. The categories in Elevate also support a grid view and list view. So if you want to lay things out in a list on top of each other, you can set that as the preferred method too. A couple of other great features uh, with the header of the site is you have a, a stick, the option for a sticky header. So that means that as you scroll down the page, see this, the logo and the navigation bar, that will stay with you and stay with the user as they scroll. Um, this gives them the ability to easily navigate the site from anywhere. Another great thing about the menu is uh, you can actually set the number of drop down columns that uh, appear in the menu. So say on the auto demo, uh, we have six columns across. So because we've got such a large library of tub categories, um, we needed to show uh, more columns across the page to fit everything. So as a setting, you can change that number to up to eight. So it'll show, change the number of columns across. On the fashion one, we've set it to five. Um, we can bring that down to three and I'll show you what happens. Once that loads, you've got three columns across rather than uh, the original five where it split everything across. So as you change that back, change it back to five, everything will split across the page correctly. So it's, it's really adaptable for small catalogs and large, uh, large websites that have multiple categories. The drop down menu, can, you don't need to have a multi-level menu as well. You can set that as a simple drop down menu. So if you change it to simple, it will just show as a regular standard fly out menu.
So if we do something like that, like that, that's how it'll display. Elevate has also been thoroughly tested on mobiles uh, and tablets. So rest assured that uh, you've got a site that's going to display correctly on all devices. So that's a little bit of an overview on our main features of our Elevate theme. Uh, we put a lot of time and effort into make the, making the theme as customizable as possible. And we've got a lot planned for our roadmap for future releases. So um, stay tuned for new features that are coming out over the next couple of weeks and months. A little bit of background info on us. Um, we're above and beyond. We've been running our business for 20 years and we've been building big commerce websites for over 10. Um, we were one of the first Australian designers to be working with big commerce. Um, so you're in good hands there. You can read some of our reviews on our reviews pages. Uh, be sure to check out our knowledge base as well with documentation that we're working on. Uh, we've already created a lot of these articles here and I'm going to be recording uh, a video series on how to do each of these steps as well. We'd love to hear from you with any different uh, feature releases and requests that you want. Uh, we're always active in development with this theme, so we'll always take on your advice and uh, your feedback. Thank you very much and have a great day. Cheers.